creatives can be disciplined. They need yeah, to be disciplined. I think, uh, you know, when we talk about disciples, it's about a discipline right. process. And right. disciplining isn't bad. I think, you know, it has these negative connotations sure. to it. But, you know, that's the thing is we have to push ourselves, whether it's waking up early, yeah. you know, delivering on time, you know, pushing yourself to say, how do you express yourself? It's, it's easy to be indulgent. It's kind of like we always equate it to marriage right. counseling. Right. I mean, it's like, you know, I, oh yeah, I have a great marriage. Yeah, yeah. Sure, yeah. sure. Well, do we have to talk about it? Do, we have to, yeah. do I actually have to delve into like, right. what, what our history is? Well, it, man, well, it's, it's funny because it seems like today there's, uh, um, we're pushing more against the creatives being disciplined than we are mm -hmm. pushing for them to be disciplined. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, oh no, no, I totally hear you. Like, like, yeah. like I'm all for like, let's do it at the creative hour. Like mm -hmm. your, your top notch creative hour mm -hmm. might be not nine to five, but mm -hmm. you know, uh, you know, six to 10 at night or whatever. But at mm -hmm. the same time though, um, we still need to get stuff done. Yeah, yeah. We still yeah. have to forget And especially stuff. like we work on a national level and actually international level and we have mm -hmm. to be accommodating to you. Okay, hey, that means 5 a.m., 6 a.m. calls. Right. To be on the East Coast to honor sure. their time. Um, but you know, there are people where, you know, their wheelhouse, you know, they are better from nine to six. Sure, right, yeah. But you know what? They should be in by nine. They, they have to be consistent in sure. that. Sure, um, you. you know, it's not just about, oh, you know. When, when you talk about cutting edge or bleeding edge, Right. You know, for us, it is about, you know, something might appear cutting edge, but for us, it's about an expression of discipline and right. how do we, how do we achieve that? And it's not, you know, we, we're firm believers that like, uh, you know, everyone, especially in American culture, right. notices um, the details. They might not be able to express it, but like, for instance, like people totally. intuitively know the difference between Disneyland exactly. and like a golf and stuff. Right. They, oh, they might sure. not be able to say, oh, it's because Disneyland creates a sense of place yep. and golf and stuff is just right. off the shelf catalog rides sure, or whatever sure, that's sure. slapped together, whatever. Right. You know, they might not be able to articulate it, but they intuitively know. No, yeah. You intuitively know if it's a B movie or if it's a yeah, blockbuster exactly. movie. Exactly. Yeah. Right, right. And, and that's the thing is that at the church, we think that if we just put bells and whistles on it, it's like, oh, all of a sudden, yeah, hey, we're using this technology. It's like, you know, it doesn't matter what technology you have. You know, you know what can you do with it? That was the great right. thing about the Blair Witch Project is because yeah. like, you know, relatively low tech. You know, they're able to do things. And when you look at even innovation and technology, I mean, I, I remember talking to a couple film guys when, you know, the 5D and stuff just came right. out and talking about doing filming with that. There was big pushback on some of these media guys. Oh, going, yeah. oh yeah, you know, that won't work. And, you know, we've been lucky to be on the bleeding edge, leading edge, sure, whatever, sure. Of, of some digital, inexpensive digital film stuff, as well as social media. Right. Uh, you know, and we were really blessed to have some, uh, you know, good friends at Facebook who mm -hmm. were really nice to us in the very beginning. And it was because on principle, we lined up with right. them. It, it, it wasn't on just like, hey, gimmicky, like, hey, just try different for different sake. Right, right. right.